Good morning. <laughs> Let's get warm. We gotta go outside. I love you. <laughs> I see Spider Man. But where's Canyon? Oh, there he is. <laughs> Let's go, dude. Good morning, everyone, and happy Monday. We're having a great morning. It is freezing cold. When I took Coda to the bus stop, it was like eight degrees, but my temperature gauge, like on your phone, where it tells you the weather, it says eight degrees, feels like negative three Fahrenheit. So, super, super cold day. We still have lots of snow. We have about a foot. You guys, we're just excited to have a great week. We have lots going on, busy Monday. Everyone's got school, everyone's got stuff to do. And today's a special day for Cody. You guys will have to wait till he's home from work to see why it is a special day for him. But we just want to say good morning. We hope you are enjoying our Try Not To Laugh Challenge today because we had so much fun filming it. And now we're going to get Carson. Hey Car. How was school, buddy? Good, what'd you learn today? I just did fun stuff. You just did fun stuff? I don't believe that. Thank you, dude. You ready for school number two? Yeah. Be a good, good friend and a good student. Okay? Okay. Hey, I love you, dude. Love you. Bye, baby. Love you. Bye. Bye, Josh. Oh my heck, I am so cold. We just got home that I was just responding to a couple comments on yesterday's video and my fingers couldn't type on my phone. <laughs> You know when you get so cold that like your bones are achy and cold? Oh. You hear my heater going though? I have it like turned up so warm in here. But right now you guys, I am going over our calendar. We have so much coming up in the next little bit. Last night, me, Shelby, Maddie, and my mom had a wedding meeting with Aubrey and her mom to start getting all the wedding plans finalized and everything because they have a super short engagement. It's like 11 week engagement. So we have a lot to do, but we have everything delegated, planned out, figured out. Sorry, my hands are so cold. But you guys, listen to everything that I'm going to be planning the next little bit. Shelby and Maddie, because you guys know they're both pregnant, then Aubrey and Matt are getting married and that's all happening within a few weeks of each other. I am throwing showers for my sisters, baby showers. We're doing quite a few, like all together, nine events. Nine. <laughs> like, get ready for a lot of baby showers and a lot of bridal showers because that is what's coming up. But I'm so excited because I have so much fun planning this stuff. Like I'm hosting a friend shower for Shelby and Maddie. So two showers in one day. And then we have a family baby shower for my sisters. And then we are doing a baby, a combined baby shower here at my house in Camas where we live because we have a ton of people here. One, two, three, four, that's four baby showers. And then Shelby's husband, Steve, his mom is throwing a baby shower. And Maddie's husband, Ryan, his mom is throwing a baby shower. We're having a family bridal shower for Aubrey. She's having a family and like Camus people bridal shower up here. And then me and Shelby and Maddie are in charge of Aubrey's bachelorette party. So as you can imagine, I have so many lists going on, so many dates running around my head. So right now I'm going over my calendar. We got a lot to plan. We got a lot to do. I don't have any time to waste, but I'm so excited. thinking that Koda's super late or something's wrong, but nope. Well, I made a racetrack. You made a racetrack? <laughs> Why are you not wearing your coat or shoes, mister? I mean, your, <laughs> your coat or gloves. That's why I sent him to school with you, stinker. Oh, troublemaker. Cool racetrack, bro. Come inside and warm up, though. It's freezing. Okay. Getting some good conditioning in for wrestling. <laughs> hey, come on, cutie. Dad just got here to have lunch with us. Come on, you're gonna get sick. Come on. But you really need a coat and gloves. Oh, come on right now. <gasps> Bro, listen. I need to show the stairs. Dad already did this morning. 
Freezing out here. Buddy, come on. And Cody just got home to have lunch with us. This had some home for lunch. Made it home for a delicious sandwich. Woo! Avocado. Turkey. You're wearing dad's hat? <laughs> so what's the big day today, guys? But I'm not gonna tell you quite yet. I'm gonna make you wait until I get home for good so I can actually explain why it's such an important day. So you'll just have to wait. Sorry. Woo! I'm back in my car. It's just me and Kenley this time though. The boys, well, Koda and Canyon, are hanging out with Nana. But you guys know how I just mentioned all the baby showers and bridal showers coming up? <laughs> well, I have a baby shower tomorrow. Not one of the ones I am in charge of. It's for my cousin. It was kind of last minute. We didn't hear about it until today. Luckily, one of my friends, one of my cute friends here in our neighborhood, she owns like a baby company. Swaddles, bibs, hooded bath towels, like super, super cute quality stuff. So it's awesome because you can buy all her stuff online and everything. It's called Captain Silly Pants. But because she's my neighbor, she has like a full inventory in her basement. So I just get to run over there really quick and grab some things for the baby. First of all, let's talk about how dang cute this packaging is. So cute. But look at this print. Um, this is a bamboo swaddle and they're like my absolute favorite, favorite thing to wrap my newborn baby in. And Kenley still has hers. You guys see her with these all the time. They are a favorite. And then I got the cutest matching bandana bib, like matching prints. She mostly wanted diapers, so we're getting her diapers, but I thought she needed something cute to go with it. So what we're getting her, I'm so excited. I love new babies. Well, hello. Are you so happy we got Garcy? Hey, dude, did you have such a great day? Yeah. Tell me exactly what you learned. <laughs> About shapes. About shapes? Yeah. Do you want mom to tell you a secret? Huh. That's my baby. <laughs> <laughs> Looks cute on you though. Mm. I couldn't find yours this morning. Hi, Hi sis. Hi, sis. Hi, sis. Hi, sis. Hi, sis. <laughs> Let's go inside, it's gold. You coming, little snow dude? Yeah. Yeah. You're so cute. And you were just talking to everyone at school, huh? <laughs> everyone says, she looks like the happiest baby. And I said, she really is. I'm like, yeah. We're so happy, huh? So I gave Canyon a donut earlier. He left it on the floor, and McKinley, now that she's crawling, she got a hold of it. Would you like to see the donut mess? <laughs> You know, all over the kitchen here. By the dining room table, the carpet. Everywhere, you guys. Donut is everywhere. Time to clean it up. That girl has gotten quick and extremely mobile in one week, but we can keep up with it, guys. <laughs> Having a crawling baby again makes you realize how scary it is to have anything on your floor. Anything. Especially when you have three boys obsessed with Legos. But floors are clean now, but I think I'm gonna mop real quick. Also, I really hope you guys enjoyed that view of my baggy sweats and Cody's old hoodie outfit today. <laughs> I'm looking real good, but you guys, it's cold. I just wanna be warm. <laughs> I spy a hot dude. Welcome Where? home. Right here, right here. Mm. Welcome home. Thank you. Okay guys, I made it home. I feel like it's time that I can tell you what happened today. <laughs> it's the anniversary. It's an anniversary. The year was 2016. January 22nd. Today. It started out as a normal day. But then, something crazy happened. We were cooking dinner eggs to be exact when this happened the epic twin egg day it's not every day that you have twin eggs for dinner and it was just a monumental day for me it's a day I'll never forget so in honor of that twin egg epic day we're having eggs for dinner it's this very <laughs> sorry that wasn't crazy <laughs> but 
It's in my calendar every year. The day we had the twin eggs for dinner. Um, and it was two years ago. Yep, 2016. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Get with the times, Get with babe. the times. <laughs> Just like maybe, I don't know, a few weeks ago, I had Cody's phone and we were going through the calendar going over dates. And I was like, yeah. what the heck is epic twin egg day? <laughs> How could you forget, babe? She was the one that actually broke the egg. It's happened like four times. It's not. It's not. It's super it's rare. Super rare that this ever and happens. Amazing. I mean, I mean, just look at that picture. It's gray, gray. It made me the man I am today. And we'll always remember that. So one very egg right here that has the mm, twin. Maybe that egg will be a twin egg. No, this. Egg is the one that had twins. How was it if that's the one we <laughs> broke? That doesn't make sense. Okay. One of you eggs. Better be a twin. That would be epic. Well, apparently I don't perform well under pressure. Oh! Oh, snap! Guys, I'm the egg pro, but not when I got a camera <laughs> filming my stuff. In her defense, I was right in her way of flipping it. I said, look out, I'm cooking here. And he said, look out, I'm filming here. I'm vlogging here. Put this on top. <laughs> Ooh, that looks yummy. It's really good. <laughs> is it good? Is it the twin egg? No twin egg. Yay! Go pebbles, it makes you melt chocolate. There you go, dude. Cereal for a car saru. Oh, mom, you did nothing. Oh yeah! There you go, sir. <laughs> Thank you! We are done with dinner, and now we're making snickerdoodles. Yeah. Oh yeah! Funny story, when Kenzie was little... I was not little, I was 17. Okay, when she was 17, <laughs> she had a dance that she would do anytime she'd make snickerdoodles. Babe, I think you need to demonstrate really this dance. I don't remember the dance. Like, I don't remember what it was. I just know I would, like, go yeah. crazy. Snickerdoodle dance. dance. <laughs> snickerdoodle dance. It was more a mood that I would get yeah. in. You want one, baby? They're yummy. What did we just learn about? Prayer and how to pray, huh? Yeah. I love you guys. Good job. I can't have one all throw up a Zumba. Don't want to do that. Kenny, you want some snickerdoodle? Yummy. Is that yummy? Maybe. That might have been a little big. Say, no way, Jose. That was so yummy. Getting ready for Zumba. Yes, sir. <laughs> He's daddy crazy. Well, that's probably going to be it for us tonight. Kenzie's headed off to Zumba. The kids are going to bed. Going to bed. This dude gets a chill. Don't know what I'll do. But thank you guys so much for watching and being here with us. It means the world. And we love you. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. It's been a great epic twin egg day. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>
Oh my goodness! Bye.